And so, my gentle reader, we have followed the foundling through his various life stages, from child to knave to Sir Winston the Magnificent, otherwise known to his close associates as Mr. Pooper Dog. Yet, there is something in his persona that is still missing. You may recall that when presented with the one thing that impassions his older sister, the lovely Princess Pearl, the object of all desire, the green golden orb, Winston showed no interest whatsoever. This yawning gap in his personality deeply troubled his doddering parents. Until one day, they noticed that Winston was gradually developing a healthy obsession of his own. It soon became an all-consuming passion. Winston, Winston and, and the Bunny Wabbit. Where's that bunny wabbit? Where is it? Winston was shocked to learn that the bunny Where's wabbits bunny were wabbit? actually at night cavorting in the backyard. One must realize that Winston's obsession is not just with the family Leporidae genus Silvilagus, commonly known as the cottontail rabbit. No, no, the bunny wabbit is much, much more than that. This, for example, is a bunny wabbit. And so is this. In fact, from Winston's point of view, all of these beasties are bunny wabbits. Winston once considered this a bunny wabbit, but learned after one unfortunate encounter that it is not. And this is definitely not a bunny wabbit, preferring to eat bunny wabbits and perhaps small dogs instead. Nor is this a bunny wabbit, Winston having been strongly advised not to consort with nocturnal animals that appear mysteriously during daylight hours. But this creature, the one who mercilessly taunts poor Winston daily, is most definitely a bunny wabbit. It seems that Winston had found a raison d'etre, a reason for being. And so he would spend the rest of his life in pursuit of his quarry, never knowing what he would do if he actually caught one. The bunny wabbit would eventually take on mythical proportions, growing larger than life. And when the time comes to cross the Rainbow Bridge, the bunny wabbit will undoubtedly lead Sir Winston to the other side. Oh.